mobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. Wobbing, 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 wobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. Hey, what is going on, fellow members of the Prank Squad? Cole here. Uh, don't know, really know if you can see me at all or that well. But anyways, this is the very anticipated unboxing video of this drone that I bought. We're gonna get more into it in just a second, but uh, let's just, uh, anyways, I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who has watched and supported the giveaway live stream. Uh, congratulations once again to the winners, and hope you guys enjoyed that little cool skit type intro I did. Anyways, let's get right into the video. Killer Keemstar style, just kidding. Alright. So, first of all, I'll start off with the pricing of this thing. This drone was $145 on Amazon. So, slice right open the box here. And it seems that they used a big box for no reason. Because it seems we only have one box inside of here. Alright, well. You can't even see what's in it, but here it is, the Hawkeye 3 quadcopter with camera, or also known as the DB Power X101, I believe. Alright, let me get this out of the box, and we'll continue with the video. Alright, I got it out of the box, and I set it up here. Sorry if this is on, like, a weird angle. Um, I'm trying to get it in the best angle, and also sorry if you hear some background noise. Uh, but anyways, upon re researching this, I'm just going to talk about this. Hawkeye 3 was a name that came up a lot, and I knew it as the DB Power X101, so I did not look at any of those. So I don't even need this knife. So let's unbox this thing, see what's in here. That's the worst part. I don't know which way is the right way. Alright, let me figure out which way is the right way and I'll pull it out of the box for you guys. Once again, sorry for the weird angles, but anyways, it comes with a nice little styrofoam casing thing that I'll probably be using because I'm not going to take the time to invest money in a case. Alright, so we remove the top and we see a bunch of contents. Alright, let's figure out what we have to work with here. Okay, I got the camera on a better angle, um, so I thought. Alright, so let's just get right in. We'll go from right to left. We'll switch it up a little bit. Alright, first thing is a screwdriver, and I don't, I'm pretty sure these might be for the controller. Yeah, these are for the controller. So, the screwdriver I know from previous videos that I've watched about this is used to put on the prop guards and landing gear. Alright, next we have the camera mount, which I'm going to be mounting my GoPro to. It's nice and comfortable in there. Got a little piece of like, kind of styrofoam material-ish. And looks like that just snaps right in. Not really sure how you're supposed to get your GoPro in there, but alright. Moving on, we have some extra propellers. I think it comes with four extra propellers, which is always nice when you wear them out and also screws to put them in. Then we have, I think these are the actual propellers. I don't know which ones we use. I don't know if it matters or not, but either we got two extra pairs of propellers or they're, I'm going to guess they're not put on. Yeah, they're not. Next, we have our prop guards, which you use screws to put on the prop guards to protect the props when you're flying. Normally inside, but for me personally, I'm going to put them on um, for the first couple of weeks that I fly it, just in case. Now, wait till you guys hear what I got with this. Some extra screws. I don't know if these are extra. I'll probably end up needing them. Um, don't know what this is. It looks like some kind of mount for something. Oh yeah, let's get into the big stuff now. The controller itself, uh, they have those analog sticks. Uh, looks very nice. Don't know what kind of, 
I didn't really hear anyone say what kind of batteries this thing required, so I guess we'll find that out soon. Uh, we have something about being happy. Um, okay, I'll set that over here so I can take a look at that. Don't really know what that was about. Uh, looks like another kind, some kind of mount or something. Don't really know what this is. Then we have the charging cable for the drone. And then we get into like all the camera stuff is over here. They stuffed it all in the same corner. Actually, let me get my knife real quick. Oh, sorry guys. Move you closer. Alright, get my knife. Ow. Ooh, that was close, so close to my hand. I just said ow because it sounded like it would hurt. Don't worry, I didn't actually cut myself. Alright, I don't want to, like I said, I don't want to damage this, so. There we go. Wow, they had that package in there tight. Um, looks like. Micro USB card, four, four gigabyte um, converter and connector for the camera, and then we have a micro USB card to a USB, so you can put it in your computer. But we won't need that unless we use this bad boy, which is what the. I'm pretty sure it's not supposed to look like that, but all right, it might. But anyways, this is like their uh, what do we call it? A knockoff GoPro. Quality's pretty bad on it, as I've seen. And a lot of these mounts and stuff that they gave me, I'm not gonna really be using. Uh, I'm gonna keep them, but I don't really need them. And this right here is perfect space for my GoPro if I ever go anywhere. Then we have a instruction animal, uh, an instruction, an instruction animal. No, we have an instruction manual for the Hawkeye Three quadcopter. Um, I'll read through that. And the first thing, by the way, I for forgot to mention the first thing I have to do before I even take this thing out for a flight is I have to register it, which is going to be a pain. But all right. Um. This is the charger, I guess. Um, has a bunch of different things on here, but this is the charger. I'm gonna set this over here for now, because now we're getting into the important stuff. Now we have the um, landing gear with some screws. The one thing I haven't seen um, is the phone mount. I don't know where that's at. Um, Maybe it's under the drone? I don't know. I don't think it was in any of these packages, so maybe we don't have a phone now? I don't know. Alright, anyways. What is that? Alright. Then we get to the bad boy. Oh, the drone himself. DB power. Um battery which is nice and here's the actual drone sorry if I was holding it too high alright I'm gonna put this together and then I'll be back with you guys shortly yeah.